grab your teacups because it's tea time. So good. So today I thought we would film a get ready with me, hence why I have nothing on my face. And I don't know what we're going to do yet, but we'll see. We'll just kind of, we'll see. So starting out, I am going to put the Maybelline Fit Me Matte and Poreless foundation on. Actually, no, I'm forgetting primer. See, I don't wear face primer a whole lot because I'm not like a big believer in it. So yeah. You know what? I'm not even going to prime. I have... Mm, yeah, I'm not even going to prime my face because I'm just... I have a sample size primer and then I have a primer that I got in my Ipsy and I just... I don't want to waste it because... Like, I wore it when I did my engagement pictures and it was awesome. But I don't want to waste it just for today. The day's like half over. It's like... What time is it? It's 1.18, so... <laughs> Yeah, we aren't doing that today. And my window is raised and I probably am I'm probably gonna have to close it because there is a bird singing. Alright. So I'm just going to dot this all over my face with my finger. How gross bacteria. But you know, you do what you gotta do. Um ee, my hair is gonna be all in this. So remember how I told you guys in my favorites video that I was going to throw away that uh, beauty sponge by e.l.f.? I didn't do it. At least not yet. I think I can get one more use out of it. I thought I'd film this video and then throw it away after this one. Because I just, I, I've got a problem with letting go. Like, what's the deal? I'm gonna have to like fast forward this because who wants to sit here and watch me like dot foundation all over my face? I'm gonna have to like figure out how to edit. I don't know how to, like I said in my first ever video, like I don't want to have like overly edited videos just lightly because you can't just, I mean, I didn't realize you can't just go without totally unediting because you might have to pause your video and get up and do something else and come back, so. It's going to have to lightly be edited. I have this all over my face. So going out with this guy that I need to damp, but I'm not going to get up and go do it. So we're just going to do it dry and see. forgot I always forget to use my elf color correcting stick and I really need to use it right here and I don't want to go like over my foundation because normally I do it under and then I blend it out but I forgot so whatever what ebbs so I am taking the elf eyelid primer in the color sheer and I just do like a line like I just put a line on there because then I take my finger and just kind of pat it in there. Now, what palette are we going to use? I know what we're going to use. The e.l.f. Mad for Matte palette because I want to do like a... What do I want to do? I don't know. My shirt is coral. And I'm wearing like a gray necklace. I kind of want to do gray, but... I kind of want to do like a peachy pink too. Hmm. All right. We are going to go in with the Eco Tools eyeshadow brush, and we are going to take this color right here and put this all over the lid, all over it. So that's that color. What else do I want to use? I don't know. I don't know what to do. What do I do? Mm, okay, yeah. Now I'm going to take the... Bum, 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 the e.l.f. eye crease brush. This brush is awesome. I highly recommend it. And I am going to go in with 
What color do I want to go in with? I'm going to go in with this color right here. This kind of lighter brown. I was going to go in with this color, but I'm kind of... Actually, you know what? I think I am going to go in with this color. No, I'm not. I feel like that's going to come out too dark. I'll go in with this color. I'm indecisive. And this is going to be for the crease. And kind of like the outer V a little bit, but really the crease. I'm just going to windshield wiper motion, put this all in here. Yeah. And somebody's mowing outside, so y'all probably hear that. Sorry. And you hear the birds chirping. So what are y'all doing for Valentine's Day? I really want to know, so please comment below like what y'all are doing for Valentine's Day because I don't really know what we're going to do yet. I mean, I really, I just, I don't know. I don't know what I want to do yet. Because Valentine's Day, I think this year is on a Tuesday. So what do you do like on a Tuesday for Valentine's Day? I think my fiance and I, I'm going to try to talk him into celebrating it like either the weekend before or the weekend after. Hopefully the weekend before, because like afterwards you're just like, eh, it's over. Valentine's Day is over. So I think, and I think that's like this next weekend. Is it this next weekend? No. I don't know. I think it is. Maybe we'll celebrate Valentine's Day this weekend. Oh no, it's not this next, it's not this weekend, it's the weekend after. And I have no idea when I'm going to put this video up, so Valentine's Day might be over by the time y'all even see this. Hopefully not. So now, I think I'm going to go back in actually in, with my crease. My crease, for, is this, this is a, that's a smudge brush. Uh, blah, 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 blah. I need to leave this stuff out. Sorry, remember to put it in the description box below so y'all know what all I used. Um, crease brush. And I'm gonna go back in with this color that I had originally put all over the lid. And I am going to put this in my crease. Because I feel like this is a more pinky, pinky color. So windshield wipers. I need to speed this up. Windshield wipers. I just took my concealer brush. I think this is the concealer brush by um, Sonia Kashuk. And I don't use it for concealer. I use it to go under my brow bone. And I took this color right here on the end. And I'm going to put that on there. Just kind of, just so you, it lightens it up a bit. What am I going to do now? I have no idea. Maybe I should have planned this out. But I don't know if it would be like really get ready with me if I planned it out. And i got to leave all my stuff out so I know what I used. Okay. Um, well, I guess we'll start finishing our eyes. Oops. I'm going to go in with the e.l.f. Intense Ink Eyeliner in Blackest Black. And I'm going to put this on the top top um lid and I need to learn how to autofocus my camera I probably should read the manual that helped out a lot so eyeliner I'm not going to use the eyeliner because it's clumpy what eyeliner do I want to use no we're not going to use that eyeliner oh but I wanted to do like a one hmm Okay, we'll use this eyeliner. Okay, I am going to use, for my bottom lash line, I'm going to use the Essence Long Lasting Eye Pencil in Black Fever. And I'm just going to line my lower lash line with it. That's what I just did. It doesn't look that great, but it's okay. It's okay. So, that is that. Now mascara. Actually, I'm not going to do my mascara yet. I'm going to go in with my favorite under eye concealer. And it's not even really a concealer, I don't think. I'm not sure. It's the Maybelline um, Instant Age Rewind. And 
I'm just like reading off the bottle, but here it is. And I just go in with this stuff. And I go, I know you're supposed to go like this or something like that, but I don't do that. I go in and I do windshield wiper motion like this. Windshield wiper motion. All right, guys, I'm, I feel like I'm like teaching y'all so wrong, but or, I don't know. I don't know. I don't know what's right and what's wrong. I'm just going to kind of do my thing. And I'm not putting too much on here just because I don't want to look like a raccoon or like, I don't know, I'm not a raccoon. When your eyes are like super bright and then your face is like darker, don't want that. So did that. And then I am going to take my nasty beauty sponge. I'm going to use this end. And dang, I forgot I didn't wet this again. Woo! I am really feeling at this. Get ready at me. Get ready at me. Get ready with me. Hopefully y'all will get a good laugh. At least. If you didn't learn anything. Or you got bored out of your mind. I don't know. If you were bored out of your mind, you probably wouldn't get a good laugh. You'd probably just like end this video. I've got to work on my videos. I don't know. I just don't know what to do. Like, I'm new here, guys. I need some, like, advice. Like, what do you do? And then I do a tiny bit right here and right here. Like, y'all guys can barely see me putting this on because I don't like using a lot. And then dot, 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 dot. And that's just so you don't look like you're just super bright right here and like nowhere else. I think is why. I'm not sure. Again, I'm not a pro. I don't know. Do y'all know? Not me. I don't know. Um, alright, so I did that. Now let's go in with mascara. I am going to use... What mascara do I use? I'm going to use this. It's the Revlon. Now to bronzer and blush. And I have no idea when I, what I want to do. I now want to use this blush. And let's use this bronzer today. Alright. So I'm going to use the Clinique um, True, True Bronze Pressed Powder Bronzer in the color 02 Sunkissed. It is super, super, super gorgeous. Gorgeous color, guys. Like, I know this is high-end, and I'm not crazy about, like, high-end makeup, actually. Or maybe I am. I just haven't tried a lot. I'm, like, a drugstore girl. But, um, this bronzer is amazing. Like, this is second up against... Actually, I think my e.l.f. bronzer and this bronzer tie. Because I really like it. Actually, this one might win. I think this is my favorite bronzer. And I don't use it a lot because... Do y'all ever have something that you like really like and then like you don't use it a lot just because you don't want it to burn out? Even though you can buy more. That's how I am. Like I hardly use it because I don't want it to run out. Oh, and I use the Sonia Kashuk, um, or Kash, yeah, Sonia Kashuk. Um, number four brush. I think it's the multi-purpose brush. It's in my favorites. Um, and now we're going to blend this out a little bit just because I feel like I went a little heavy on it. Actually, no. We're going to be heavy today. Um, I'm going to take this blush that I got in my Ipsy bag. It is the Model Company blush in the color Peach Bellini. This is a really pretty blush, guys. But I haven't really used it yet, so we'll see. But, like, I swatched it, and it's really pretty. And we are going to go in with the Sonia Kashuk. I just hit my elbow. Um, the Sonia Kashuk. I think it's a blush brush, but I'm not sure. Top off the excess. Okay. 
Boom shakalaka. This blush is so pretty. Ooh, I really like this. Wow, I think I, I gave this a, like a four-star review on Ipsy and not five. I should have done that. Dang, this stuff looks good. I think I went a little too heavy on it, but hey. Anyways, I mentioned um, Coffee Break with Danny earlier, and I don't even know if I finished what I was saying. But she always says that she goes like too heavy, like she can't put her brushes down. And I'm the same way. Is anybody else the same way? Because I am. And I was like, girl, no way. Twins. But um, she's like a great YouTuber. You'll have to check her out. I love her videos. Like, she's got one of those personalities that... I'm all about people in their personalities. Um, <laughs> uh, first of all, hold on. I'm going in with the e.l.f. Illuminating Palette. And this is what... I'll show you all the color. I'm going to use this color for my highlight. All right, so back with back to Coffee Break with Danny. She is super awesome, and again, like I was saying, okay, I'm gonna go in with the Sonia Kashuk whatever this brush is. I'll try to look it up and see. Um, but Coffee Break with Danny, she is too too cool. Like, and she's not boring. Like, you know how sometimes you're watching a video and it might be your favorite YouTuber, but they're just like in that video they're boring, probably like how I am in this video. Um. <laughs> And you're watching them and they're just boring. Like, Coffee Break with da Danny is never boring. And she talks and talks and talks and talks to you. Like, it's like, yeah. Yeah, it's like you're actually having a conversation. But you're not because you've never met her in your life. But she's, like, super cool. So y'all have to go check her out. But back to why I was even talking about her. She will be, like, going crazy on the... Okay, I'm not going to use this. Uh, crazy on like the blush or the bronzer or whatever. And she'll keep going. She's like, okay, put the brush down, Danny. And like, she won't. And then like, her makeup, it still looks gorgeous. But I guess she like has more on there than what she had wanted or planned. And guys, I don't do highlight right. Like, I don't know how to do highlight. And now this looks kind of powdery. But you know... So, are we done? I think we did. Oh, lip. And I didn't do my brows. Because I don't do my brows a lot. What do I want to use of my lip color? This is kind of pretty. This is new. But I want to show you this in the next video. So I'm not going to use it. Actually, I'm not even going to put a lip color on because of the next video I'm going to do. So, that is it, guys. Yeah. That's it. No, it's not. I, I better do a lip color. Yeah, I better do a lip color. Okay. Um, I'm going to go in with my favoritist ever. I know favoritist isn't a word. But I'm going to go in with my favorite lipstick. It's by NYX or NYX. I'm not sure how to say it. It's in the color T-Rose. I think this is in my favorites as well. And it is a gorgeous color. So I'm going to put this on the lips. Okay, so I have a question for y'all. Hold up. Hold up. I know this probably doesn't look great, but... Do y'all prefer lipstick or lip gloss? Comment below. Because I am really intrigued by... Do y'all like lip gloss or lipstick? Or like liquid lipstick or lip balm what's your favorite comment below let me know because I personally love creamy lipsticks like this one um, I think this is actually called extra creamy lipstick by NYX or NYX I'm not sure how to say it and it is amazing And like, lipsticks like these are the lipsticks I love. And this one like feels really good on the lips. And I got this uh, over me, but whatevs. So, that is today's look, guys. My, my voice went out for a minute. Um, so, I don't know. Did I do everything? I feel like I'm missing something. 
have done something. You know what? Let's do brows. Let's do brows just for the heck of it. I'm going to go in with the e.l.f. Um, brow pencil in the color neutral brown. And I just lightly put this on my brows because I already have like super dark brows. And I'm not one of those girls. I know some people like they have to have their brows done. Like they'd prefer to have their brows done over anything else. I'm not one of those girls. I don't care if my brows are done or not. <laughs> but I have like super dark brows. So I guess that's why I'm not sure. Like why do people like to do their brows? I don't know. I mean it does make them look fuller but ooh, it's a little dark. We are going heavy today guys. Tried to do a simple look. Ended up heavy. I guess that's how it's going to go. And then I'm going to take this little thing and just kind of I go okay so what I do is I go over but then I come back and I go this way kind of lifting my hairs just so that the color like really gets in there and like smudges in there like I feel like it helps it I don't know I might be crazy but I feel like it helps with like dispersing the color I guess I don't know I just think it looks better after I do that. I don't know what it does. And I went like super heavy on those brows. Like girl. <laughs> so that is my get ready with me. Woohoo. Um, sorry it wasn't the best. I promise guys. It will get better. I am learning. <laughs> so yeah. My eyebrows are acting crazy. I need to get these things trimmed. Um, or waxed. But yeah, this is my look today. So I promise these will get better. Hopefully, I hope. Y'all hope too. Um, if you like, like watching me or you're subscribed to me. But anyways, um, if you liked this video, then please subscribe and give me a like. Um, please comment below with what I told y'all to comment below. Like, girl, we will we will talk it out. Talk, talk. We will talk it up in the comments. So um, comment below, especially about the lipstick question because. I really want to know. I'm intrigued by this because I'm not crazy about lip glosses. I'm like a lipstick girl. Can you be like both? I'm not sure. Comment below. So y'all have a great day beauties. I hope you enjoyed this video and again if you did like and subscribe please. Bye guys.